When sexual orientation came for the first time, uh, it, it really shook the system. We had like huge and huge of attacks from human rights organizations. They seemed to think that we were imposing on a space that we, we, we didn't belong to. There were all sorts of other human rights violations. Why were people focusing on this? How dare you? Like, why do you think that this is a human rights issue? How can this be a human rights issue? C'est un virus nouveau qui date depuis qui date depuis quelques années pour diviser les Africains. The first step was to convince the NGO forum that this is an issue of concern at the continent. As police begin to enforce new laws that criminalise same-sex marriage. She's a lesbian attacked for being an African. Of course, they are disgusting. It's on African, it's on ethical, it's on godly. We fought. We, we had to make the space un ungovernable. It almost got physical in the space. It was rough. We understand, you think this is vile, you think this is un-African, unholy, good. But we are human, can you stop killing us? Can you stop torturing us? Can you stop raping us? Can you stop forcing out, us out of our homes, out of our jobs, out of our communities, and out of our churches? Can you stop? Silence about your issues. It's just like death to life. And, and, and I can't afford to die by not speaking. I, I would rather speak 